I'm Patrick Mart, one of the managers here at Model Services and Hasbro. And what we do is we create all the prototypes in, that are required for development of any of our uh, samples. So what you see here is a nice uh, sort of selection of all the different stuff that we work on in a given year. Um, we're roughly a group of about 40 individuals, all different disciplines. We have traditional model makers, we have people that do CAD, we have photographer, electronics, soft goods. Between all of us, we can make stuff. Some of the other stuff that we work on are animatronic stuff. And so here you see Elmo without plush on him. And this is where we really think the magic is. So uh, everybody understands Elmo when he has his plush on, but the magic is really in the mechanism and the coating to get him to look lifelike. So this is what we like to show. Mark Maha. Transformer model artist. My background is actually a graffiti background. A lot of the spray techniques, a lot of the airbrushing, a lot of the hand painting actually was a natural transition for me. But the coolest thing about all of this is any store I go to and they carry Transformers, I can look at the back of the package and see the model that I've painted because this is the exact model that I paint on every package they photograph it. So that's kind of awesome, you know what I mean? I can go wherever I want, pick up a package and be like, yeah, that's the model I painted. So, it's kind of cool. Brian Winters. I'm a master model maker here at Hasbro. Part of my role here is developing prototypes and samples of toys. This would be an example of a model built in SolidWorks, and that's the program I use here to model. With basic geometry, you can build these structures uh, with, you know, some reference ideas, and you're off and running.